Alrighty, hi there, I'm Val. We're doing the whole recording thing today because the new SpongeBob SquarePants DLC came out. Look, we've all been ready for this. Now, we're doing something a little bit weird, and if I might mess up, but we're currently doing this Discord style. <laughs> I'm in Discord sharing the screen and, and having people watch there so this way they can see what I actually do. And it's be like a nice little community thing because if, uh, I, I didn't want to do it on Twitch. So I'm sorry if you sometimes hear little weird sounds from Discord. I feel bad, but it's just the way it is. But we got a new special nozzle and everything, so we don't get to use our super duper power one. However, we get to, we, we, we get to hear from SpongeBob SquarePants. Oh, I... I, I I feel like I need, like, an AI voice to read this, so it gets, like, the peak Spongebob-ness. But, it's a power washer, and boy, we are glad you're here. We woke up this morning to find our house is completely covered in dirt, and none of us can figure out how. Absolutely nothing happened that night, except for the surprise birthday party for my pet snail, Gary. It was amazing. Everyone showed up, even the tube worms from Rock Bottom and the sea monkeys and Dennis. We probably made the most mess by anyone ever. But we definitely cleaned up afterwards, or did I fall asleep and dream that bit? Anyway, our neighbor Squidward blames us, and he says that the house isn't clean by the time he gets home from making comedy history at the gala, then he'll do something we'll all regret. If you clean all three, we'll give you all Krabby Patties, all the Krabby Patties you can eat. I'm sure Mr. Krabs won't mind, maybe. Oh, that's so cute. Now, there is 10 new DLCs for the game. And the DLCs are pretty e the not the DLC, the achievements are pretty easy. Uh, there is to complete the jobs of the new levels, as well as cleaning something in particular. Whereas before you had stuff like in the subway platform, you had to clean the advertising uh, boards first, and that was the only one for that. There's actually two achievements per level. So for conch, for the conch street job, we got naughty nautical neighbors, which is to complete the job. And then we also got the awesome SpongeBob reference. It's not a boulder, it's a rock. In which during this job, we have to complete the rock hinge, rock underside, and Patrick rock last. So we'll be doing that ourselves. Oh my god. They made everything like cell shaded. Oh, this is amazing. Imagination box. I'm assuming that's just going to be so much references to the show. Like, I think the dirt came here because it wanted to oh my god we're gonna get tech we're gonna get messages from, from from patrick like we got the reef blower his bicycle if, if i was dirt i would want to live here and that's all my friends now we can open patrick's house oh that's amazing and you guys tv and stuff like that and there's sea fungus. Oh, they they look like they had some party. All right. Um, I guess we'll start with the SpongeBob house because that's just right here. However, we do not have our super duper handy dandy awesome blasters, so it will take us a second. But I think, look. We're cleaning water, dirt with water. It would be more, it would, I think it'd be funnier if it was air that we're putting out instead of water, but I still think it's nice. All right, so the sign is, oh, power wash simulator. You gotta make sure you get underneath the cracks as well. All right. Um, do I need a scaffolding already? No.
No, when I can just do it Val style and just walk on top of it. All right, that's all good. You can pick that up and we'll start cleaning the, the stepping stones here. Now we do have, um, the deep cleaner. I don't know if we'll be able to buy stuff for it, but it does come with all the extensions, soap and all of that, except the uh, trident from the last bit. I wonder if there is anything new in the store clothing wise. No. And it doesn't seem to be any uh, skins for it either. But that's fine. I think the base skin is pretty nice. Tell me I'm still missing some. There we go. I will say they did have some kind of party last night. I mean, look at this. This is a... Uh, what is that? Algae? It kind of looks like a... Uh, sponge vomit a little. I don't know. It's currently one o'clock and the steam sale also started today. And instead of being so excited for the steam sale, I'm just like... Spongebob DLC. I have been so hyped for this DLC, it is unreal. Oh, each one of these is a different one. Okay. I can already tell we're going to need this. Oh my god, you just randomly hear Gary. That's awesome. Alright. We might have to get the, uh... A scaffolding at some point. What am I standing? Oh, nope, just casually back up onto the, uh bubble stand I see how it is there we go yeah it looked like that they had some kind some fun last night Sorry about that. I, uh, we're planning on going a tr on a trip soon. And uh, these are going to be uploaded today on Thursday, which is why we're doing it on Discord, not stream on Steam, on a Twitch. But also the fact that these are going to be going up as my uploads for YouTube. So it's, it's kind of like a double edged sword. So I'm just like, I want to get through the CLC so this way I can I can show people the achievements and the awesome levels. But at the same time, the Steam sales going on, and I'm just like, part of me wants to know what's on sale, but alas, stuff must get clean. All right, let's see here. I think we're gonna do SpongeBob's house, and then maybe we'll do jump cuts. I, I, I know you all like the power washing and all of that, but levels like this, there's a lot of double checking, and it's a lot of uh, downtime in between. Got to make sure we get that.
we can hear Gary again, which is a really nice touch. What is that? Snail trail? Oh my god, Gary, are you actually here? Or... Oh my god. Hold on, M let me turn it up. It is so subtle. You make sounds like you're walking in SpongeBob. They went really ham for the, uh, for this DLC. I mean, come on, we even, we even have the imagination box. Like, we're just getting iconic stuff from Spongebob right here. I mean, down to the bubbles, the graphic designs, and then even the fact... Wait a second. Our gloves aren't gloves. Are we fish? My gloves are white. I think we're a fish. I just realized that. There we go. I guess it's Shane thing. I'm over here thinking like, oh, this looks really orange. It's like, oh, it must be just dating. If I was dirt, I would live here too, Patrick. We, Patrick's already told us that. Is he now texting us from SpongeBob's phone? And I want you to live right down the way. Aww. I make sure we get all up in there and I want a dirty little Squidward to live next door uh, Oh, we do get an extra long reach oh, There's a jellyfish Sorry I'm, I'm getting very distracted. All right, I think it's to the point. We're gonna move this over to Squidward's house. So we can bring the scaffolding a little bit closer. Oh my God, even the scaffolding makes the noises. I might've put this a little too close. But now we can clean a lot more efficiently. There we go. I'm like, yeah, I'm going to start recording this. I'm going to get through like a level in like an hour and it's going to go by so quick and I'm going to miss it. And I'm just like, wait a second, it's power wash simulator. I have to double whatever time I thought it's going to take.
Oh yeah, this gets up in there so we can hit it from the top. That sounded so wrong. We're gonna have to bring the scaffold into the other side. It's gonna be clean what we can see now. Okay, the pineapple leaves are all one thing. All right. Okay, I can go up even higher. I feel like this is too high. Maybe because of Squidward's house. Oh, I did not mean to fall in. I mean... This isn't the worst case scenario. It does let me get to the angles that I need to. All the leaves are different. They're not shared. Oh, never mind. My joy went out of the window just a little bit. I thought they were all shared. I'm like, oh, cool. So they're all doing at the same time. All right, most of this is gonna have to be from the outside, right? Really? Can this not go here because of the stand? All right. Well, at least I don't have to clean the random rocks. All right, let's clean these mother, these mother leafers. Give them the best cleaning that they've ever had. I know what I, I I know there are some levels in here. Uh, they pretty much said all of the levels going in and the DLC the uh, achievements also tell you. I, I kind of want to see what the invisible boatmobile will be like. I hope that it's just floating dirt and then you clean it and it just goes invisible. Like no outline, no nothing, just invisible. Well, I figured I'm already here. I might as well try to clean 
some of the sides. Because why shouldn't I be able to sit on top of SpongeBob's house and clean it? The inner, like... I, I haven't watched SpongeBob in a while. Because I, I, I don't watch, like, I watch a lot of TV. I don't watch a lot of, like, cartoons anymore. I can get all this with the uh, extra long, hopefully. Like, if it's on, sometimes I'll watch it. But for the most part, I usually, uh, I want to say around the time the second movie came out and they put the musical on, I really really did not keep up with it. Um, I mean, you just know so much of the old SpongeBob stuff that it, it old SpongeBob and new SpongeBob can really be categorized as almost two different shows in a weird way. Just because of how different the characters are. They start leaning to her tropes a lot more. And there's nothing wrong with that. But it's just... I can't tell you the last time I've watched. Well, my... Uh, looks like the leaves are all done. I could have sworn that I said I had one to still clean. No. All right, let's check our handy dandy notebook to see. Bubble stand container. Okay, apparently a SpongeBob's house. For front door for a dollar. Okay. Garage door alcove. Bikini bottom pineapple pan panels. All right. Excuse me, by the way. And wreath blower nozzle. There you go. Now the next thing on here is Squidward's house. All right, so I think we're gonna do this a little bit differently. Unless I see something very noteworthy, I think we're gonna clean half of Squidward's house. And then we'll I forgot how to rotate my nozzle for a second. And then uh, we'll see you guys in a moment. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna just do one half of it. This way we can do like a comparison thing because that took us 20 minutes. So this should take us about maybe 10 to do one side. I think I'll do the left side. All right, we'll see you in a moment. So I'm just over here and, and I'm cleaning the back side of the house. I know. D don't don't at me with I said I'm only gonna clean half. I I ended up cleaning three quarters of it. But anywho. Why can't I control this so far away? Do I have a secret remote I didn't know about? But we got the uh, bicycle from the infamous episode where he goes to the community. Well, at least that's the episode that I know of. The episode in which all he wants to do is relax. And when he can't, he puts his chair on the roof. Hoping people would stop bothering him. And uh, we did just about half. 
just, just about I need to take this up and actually put it to the front because I have to get up top of stuff and I just don't have the angles to it and I was so deathly afraid of messing up the symmetry line of yeah that is the uh information I'm going to go with I'm gonna have to put that on the other side and I But now we get to sit here and we're gonna clean this part with you. And then uh, when we do a next jump cut, we'll probably be closer to the end of the level and we'll show off how to do the achievement. Let's clean this all up. All right, that's stuff I can get from the bottom. I need stuff from the uh, top done. All right. Clean, 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 clean. Fall off. Okay. Let's just reposition this now then, I guess. Yeah, we have soap and I, I think I should have used it. Well, the nose is done. I, I'm I'm dying. I'm not dying, but I would I want to know what the next uh, level is. I have a feeling the Murma layer is going to be last. Just because that would make the most sense. Wait, you never bought the last rebirth DLC? I, I said I would mess up. Recording Val's reading Discord chat and responding. <laughs> I said it was gonna happen. I said I'm gonna forget that I'm actually recording a segment. But hey, at least it's not what I did the one time and put One Piece full blast over the whole recording. Yeah, that's why there's no boat level for the career mode. I legit forgot to pause the recording, put One Piece on so this way I could clean to something other than the silence of the game. And then I record and it was just recording the whole time. Yeah, Back for Blood is dead. Did it again? Back for Blood is currently on sale on the Steam sale for 80% off. And ever since they announced that they stopped working on it, it's still a really good game and DLC. It, it's not as replayable as Left 4 Dead was. And I think that's just because the overall design of it is. Back for Blood's a lot more serious over tone while Left 4 Dead remains some kind of cartoonish arcade-like to it. But I recommend Back for Blood in a heartbeat. Maybe I'll pick up the last DLC.
so if the dirt was dealt with but our houses were all filthy again when we woke up that can only mean one thing oh my god you're gonna say plank then we're off the hook okay i mean that certainly is a thing all right it's time to go to our handy dandy notebook all right we're doing squidward's house and it is all clean now for patrick's house we do have an achievement for it and the achievement let me open up steam real quick wait hold on i could just use the new shift tab the new steam ui it's a boulder it's not a boulder it's a rock in the country job do the rock rock hinge and rock underside underside last all right i feel like that's easy enough to do and we'll check the handy dandy notebook of cleanliness before we do that all right so we're going to clean up everything else except for the last three for the achievement and we will be right back all righty we finished up the whole inside we got a tv and all that little bins now we're on to the last three which is the rock the rock the rock underside and the rock hinge which is the last thing we need for the achievement so now all we have to do is just clean the inside and we'll get the achievement and we'll be good to go to the next level all in all the first level took me about an hour to do the video is going to be around 30 because I, I did all of Spongebob on camera versus the jump cuts of the other two. Uh, I want to say it actually took the longest because of all the leaves in the small areas, which to be honest is kind of expected if you really think about it. All right, let's let, let's see. If, hold on. I don't play Power Wash Simulator for a week, and I suddenly can't do. Controls. But this is the achievement portion. I want to make sure this gets on. You don't need to stop. Sorry, Sophia came in and was like, I need to stop buying games on the Steam sale. I got like 10 indie games already. Clean, 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 clean. Just try and get the top side done so this way we can just hit it from the bottom. There we go. Nice stro small strokes downwards and we'll just eventually clean everything. I've learned this is the most like efficient way to clean quickly because as you go down the slower you do, you can cover great distances and still clean. Like, we're going to start here. And as long as we keep it in the same direction. Boom. 100% clean. Because instead of going like this, and you slowly have to either do smaller strokes from left to right. This, you can just go down dr gradually and pick up everything which I greatly appreciate. All right, 
I just need to do the hinge. I'm assuming I need to hit it from the sides. Yeah. And there we go. It's not a boulder, it's a rock, and not a cool naughty neighbors. We're done with the first level of the SpongeBob DLC. Oh my god, we are a fish. That is amazing. Their gifts run up really nicely. Barnacles be gone, your angry little squirter is a wonder. Sandy's gotta see all this thing, she's gonna love it. All right, so that was the first deal. the first level of the new SpongeBob SquarePants DLC for Power Watch Simulator. I'm Val. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time for the Bikini Bottom Bus.